In this video, you'll see an InterSystems IRIS application that provides automated receipt processing for patients picking up prescriptions at a pharmacy. Patients and pharmacies use automated receipt processing for reimbursements or to detect mistakes and fraud. The main functional component of the application is a logical flow called a production, which connects systems that use different communication protocols and message formats. The production sends an image of the receipt to an external computer vision service which extracts text from the image. Next, production logic verifies that all necessary information was read on the receipt, including the provider name and the patient number. As a courtesy service, the production then checks for anomalous prescription information by running the prescription info through a machine learning model. Finally, a database of drug interactions is searched so the user can be informed about their prescriptions. If this application were built in Iris for Health, Connections could be made to electronic medical records and include patient history in the production logic. Let's take a look at a local version of this application built in a Docker container. The files for the InterSystems IRIS container consist of some configuration files, a data folder, and custom class files for the production. There is also a container with an Apache Zeppelin notebook where the app's machine learning model was built before being imported into the production. Now let's look at the production. The first thing to notice is that in this version of the application, there is an email inbound adapter that allows patients to email a photograph or a screenshot of their receipts to a dedicated email server instead of using a mobile application. In InterSystems Iris for Health, productions like this can be attached to fire servers for automated processing of incoming data such as claims. In the middle column, the business process called Receipt Processing handles the logical flow of the production, including calls to external services. To follow the data flow, let's open Receipt Processing using the BPL Editor, a low-code interface. First, the image is sent to a text extraction service hosted in Microsoft Azure Cloud. The recognizer extracts information from the given text. Then the business process looks up the patient in the registry database and checks the receipt for complete information. If the receipt is complete, a machine learning model is invoked to detect anomalies in the prescriptions on the receipt. This machine learning model has been ingested into InterSystems IRIS using Predictive Model Markup Language, or PMML, and is run in real time on the incoming receipt data. At the same time, an external database is used to retrieve drug interactions for the medications in the prescription. Finally, the email response operation is called. Let's see it in action. I send an email to the designated mailbox with the subject line, My Receipt 1. I attach my first receipt, which is missing the prescriber name. After a minute, I receive a response saying my receipt has incomplete information. It is missing the prescriber name. Now I send an email with a second receipt and call it My Receipt 2. On this receipt, the prescriber name has been printed. So the response email tells me it has complete information, but it needs review by a human. The production configuration also provides a detailed view of the email processing. This is the message viewer, which shows all the messages passed between the components of the production. Each session shows all the messages produced when a new email is received. In the full trace, it's possible to see the data passed between system components, including the full text extracted from the receipt and the prescriber information from the recognizer. For the incomplete receipt, no matching learning model was invoked because the receipt was rejected. For the complete receipt, the machine learning model was invoked in real time and returns an aggregate score. Now that you've seen an application for automated receipt processing in InterSystems Iris for Health, consider using similar components to connect your data to AI services for validation and automated notifications.